Hey everyone, it's John here from Otakaki, back with another video. I want to talk about this big mock trade, and Jesse Pollock was the first one to bring it up, I believe. I think I saw a TikTok, so I want to give credit to him. But I do want to talk about it because other people on Twitter are talking about it, on YouTube. Wow. I mean, William Nylander for Tom Wilson would be a massive blockbuster deal. Uh, I did want to talk about it, so it's one of those things that I don't know if there's too much, like in terms of sources, too much kind of... Uh, smoke right now to it, but in terms of fit, in terms of what we could see in terms of a bigger deal, it's possible. I don't know if I love it in terms of one for one. I, I think Nylander has shown that his value in terms of production, in terms of uh, driving his own line, like Wilson is more of that complimentary piece, more of that maybe second guy on a line where Nylander's shown that he can drive his own line at times. So I think in terms of, if you're the Leafs, who you target on Washington, I think you look at Tom Wilson, you look at Lars Zeller, you look at Ilya Samsonov. I would even throw in a guy like Mantha. Those are some targets that you maybe see as fits for your team. I think for Lars Zeller, that would be a perfect third line center. Samsonov, will he get, uh, I would say, a long-term deal with the Capitals? Will he stay with the Capitals long-term? And then, of course, Tom Wilson just fits that bite, fits that goal scoring plus the bite for a uh, potential trade for the Leafs. But... Well, the Leafs trade Nylander, everything's kind of pointed towards in terms of what Dubas has said, in terms of what other people have talked about, the Leafs will not trade Nylander. But it's something to talk about. I think when Jesse brought it up and other people have talked about it on social media, it's something I wanted to talk about. Uh, so is it a huge blockbuster deal that happens or is it something that could potential or potentially go down or a trade in general between the Leafs and Capitals? Like in the Leafs perspective here, if you can just target a guy like Lars Eller specifically for your third line, move David Camp to the fourth line, like that could be a really good potential for the Leafs. So I think in terms of the Toronto Maple Leafs, they need some more bite, but maybe some more depth as well after losing Nazem Kadri, uh, maybe a third line center, an improved third line center, not to shade David Camp because he did have really good moments, especially in the first round, but uh, it's never a bad thing to have more center depth. So I want you guys to give me your thoughts. I just, again, I think it's one of those things where you talk about uh, both teams kind of needing a shakeup, the Capitals losing in the first round again, the Leafs losing in the first round again. Ovechkin is not getting any younger, getting him another cup potentially. It's not a bad thing to shake things up. You have a guy like Nick Backstrom, the Swede, maybe getting him with a fellow Swede and William Nylander. Again, it's just spitballing, and I, it was an idea thrown out there. And as someone that likes to talk hockey, likes to talk about potentials, um, I just wanted to throw it out there in terms of uh, who knows. We'll see. And it's, it's just good to talk about sometimes and have some fun. So let me know if you guys think something like this is realistic or if William Nylander could get traded this offseason. Tom Wilson, I do also want to say before people are leaving in the comments. Wilson is injured and on recovery, so he's not gonna return until like December. So in any scenario where you trade a guy like, or trade for a guy like Tom Wilson, he'll be out for the first couple months. So um, yeah, again, let me know if you guys think a big trade could happen between these two teams or in general between some of these players. Uh, subscribe, like, and comment. Notification bell, do all that good stuff, and I'll see you on the next video or stream. Have a good one. Peace out.